Today is a big day across the league for prospects to go out and visit teams. The San Francisco 49ers do this thing where they bring in a bunch of prospects at one time. Instead of just individual visits, they do a group visit. And the first time I remember them doing this was back in the 2019 draft when they brought in Inkeel Harry, they brought in Debo Samuel and A.J. Brown all at the same time. And as we saw, the 49ers opted to go Debo Samuel over A.J. Brown when it was all said and done. And Adam Peters is also doing the same exact thing with the Washington Commanders right now. He has J.J. McCarthy. He's got Jaden Daniels. He's got Michael Penix. He's got the top quarterbacks amongst other players all visiting with Washington. And obviously, he's taken that thought process from the San Francisco 49ers and is now implementing it with his new team. But the San Francisco 49ers are doing it right now, and they are bringing in some players that have been connected to them throughout the process and some players that I think 49er fans would actually like to see um, drafted by the 49ers, starting with these two. As you can see, you have Sione Vaikai, who uh, played a little bit of running back with Utah, but has been primarily a safety and a pretty darn good safety at that. And you also have Kingsley Suomatia as well, who has been connected or mocked to the San Francisco 49ers at pick 31. He's a guy that I've talked about on my channel quite a bit. Sione has been linked to the 49ers a bunch of times as well. And um, Sione posted to his social media, uh, him and Kingsley, at the 49ers facility. I'm also seeing from Steph Sanchez that uh, DeCamerion Richardson um, is also visiting the San Francisco 49ers today, and I had a chance to speak to him at the NFL Combine where he told me he had a formal meeting, and so clearly they have stayed in touch throughout this process. DeCamerion Richardson also ran a sub 4 4 40, very fast, has great length, and could definitely be a cornerback that the San Francisco 49ers target. I'm also seeing from Steph Sanchez that Michael Hull Jr. is in the building. He is a defensive lineman that I have broken down out of Ohio State. He is a very, very intriguing prospect. He's young, and he can rush the passer from the interior, arguably one of the best interior pass rushers um, in this class. Also, offensive tackle out of Penn State. Tevin Wallace is visiting, and um, it does sound like there's a bigger and broader group um, that is there in San Francisco uh, right now. So as we know, the draft is about two weeks away, and so it is time. It's time to get, get going and get these prospects uh, figured out, met who they are, get a and and these meetings are really big because yes you can be a good football player but the 49ers have made it abundantly clear that they have a huge emphasis on personality um because the personality what is kind of ingrained into you as a person like seeps into the culture and that's how you develop. You hear that that term thrown around quite a bit, and you hear it talked about with the San Francisco 49ers having a really good culture. What that means is just having a bunch of really good guys who love football, love to work, and you put them in the same environment, and that just builds, and they feed off of each other. It's when you kind of plop in. George Kittle's talked about this. You plop in a bad egg. And the 49ers have been really good and quick to get that person out. So this is an important part of the process. You know, the hardest thing to do in this process is scouting the person. Anyone can watch the tape and see if you're good or you're not good. They're trying to determine, do you have the makeup to be able to become better and excel in this league, when you get the money, when the, the accolades come, all those things, they just want to know that you're going to keep grinding. Um, so today is a big day for uh, meetings, and we are going to see 
who else is there. But so far, uh, a decent amount of um, decent amount of people showing up. And like I said, uh, we'll definitely probably get a better list uh, of this whole situation playing out sooner rather than later. And so if we get more information on people who are showing up, we will bring it to you ASAP. So uh, let me know what you guys think about some of these players that the 49ers have brought in for visits. Let me know who you think the 49ers should draft. And if you want to talk draft sleepers, I will be on Bleacher Report. It currently at the time of recording this video, it's Tuesday, April 16th in about 20 minutes it's 11 40 right now at noon pacific standard time i will be on bleacher report talking draft sleepers so if you get here if you get to the end of this video before noon pop on over to bleacher report on the app and we will be talking draft sleepers come join the conversation i would appreciate it let me know who you guys thinking before our draft in the comments below and as always make sure to like and subscribe for more updates